Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. In this video, we are going to learn about 8 is to 1 mux, that is the multiplexer. But before that, I have uploaded the video of what is multiplexer and 4 is to 1 multiplexer. I will ask you guys to please check that. So what 8 is to 1 multiplexer will do is n is to 1 mux. Here n equal to what? 8. So we have 8 is to 1 mux. Let's check out the block diagram of this. n equal to 8 means we have n input i0, i1, i2 till i7. So i0 to i7 will be 8 number of input and we have 1 output that is y. Now to find the number of the selection line we have the equation this 2 to the power m equal to n where m is equal to the number of the selection line and n is e equal to the number of the inputs that is here 8 so 2 to the power m equal to 8 that is 2 to the power 3 and m equal to 3 so we have three number of the selection line we will name it three number of the selection line now we will look at the function table of this mux so we have three selection line s2 s1 and s0 so here we are what we will have 2 to the power 3 means 8 so 8 combination of 0 and 1 will be here so we'll start with 0 0 0 0 1 1 1 1 then 0 0 1 1 0 0 1 1 0 1 0 1 0 1 0 1 so when s2 s1 is 0 all three are 0 then the value of output will be i0 when s0 is 1 and s2 and s1 is 0 0 then i1 similarly we will get others i2 i3 i4 i5 i6 and i7 now let's check out the expression for the y that is the output of the 8 is to 1 multiplexer and here we will write the expression in the form of the sop that is the sum of product where in sum of product 0 is considered as negation term negation and 1 is as it is so like here s2 is 0 so we will write s2 bar okay similarly s1 is 0 so we will write s1 bar and s0 is s0 bar and what we will get the output when all three are in uh, negative term that is a 0 we will get i0 so we will write i0 plus now for the second term for the i1 we have s2 as 0 so we will write s2 bar s1 as 0 s1 bar s0 as 1 so s0 output will be i1 plus similarly other terms we will write s2 as 0 s2 bar s1 as 1 s1 and s0 bar i2 plus other terms s2 bar s1 s0 i3 s2 s1 bar s0 bar i4 plus for the i5 s2 s1 bar s0 i5 plus for the i6 we have s2 s1 s0 bar i6 for i7 we have all three one so s2 s1 s0 i7 so this is the boolean expression of y that is the output of the s8 is to 1 multiplexer hope you all are getting how we have derived the value of y now we will make the second diagram for the 8 is to 1 mux by the help of the logic gates and this expression for the y so here we have s2 s2 s1 s0 three selection line so first we will draw the three selection line and its negative term okay we have three s0 s1 s2 as the selection line and their negative term s0 bar this is s1 bar and this is s2 bar now according to this expression we will make now for the first term we have s2 bar 
so we will take like this start with the first here s2 bar now s1 bar so we will take this one that is s1 bar and uh, now s0 bar so we will take this one okay and i0 let's say this is i0 and there is and operation in between so we will put a and okay now what is this this is our first term s2 bar s1 bar s0 bar i0 similarly we will make the other terms now for the second term we have s2 bar s1 bar s0 and i1 here s2 bar s1 bar s0 i1 so we will make s2 bar okay this is the s2 bar s1 bar s1 bar and s0 s0 and i1 okay similarly we will make all other gates for the last term s2 s1 and s0 i7 okay now there is or operation in between all term so here we will draw an or gate a big or gate and will connect every output of and gate to this And here we will get our output of 8 is to 1 max. If the video was helpful to you, please share with your friends and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.